friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach. I follow Weight Watchers and I count calories and macros. Happy Saturday, it's Saturday so it's grocery haul day. I have some good stuff to share with you, lots of good recipes coming your way so if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not because I do a grocery haul every Saturday and I upload five videos per week. Check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching. I I do offer personalized macros and calories, highly recommend, and one-on-one -on -one coaching for accountability and to talk with me directly. Links, discounts to my favorite things, and come join our Facebook group. We would love to have you. So let me turn you around and let's jump into this week's grocery haul. So this week I did my grocery shopping at Walmart. We didn't need a whole lot this week, but I am going to be making Troy's favorite pasta salad for him. And then we just needed to stock up on some staples. And I did pick up a couple of new things. So let's jump into the grocery haul. The first thing I picked up is this huge pack of ground beef. And then I just now realized I forgot to buy Manwich, which I was buying for Troy to make him sloppy joes this week. So I will have to grab a can of Manwich, but this was on sale. This is just 73, 27 ground beef. I'm not going to be eating the sloppy joes. He is, so I don't mind what fat content I get in the ground beef. And then I also picked up some ground chicken. This is for a dinner recipe. I was so excited that Walmart had so many of these tuna creations. I have really fallen in love with these. It is such a great way to get in protein. I've been using my pepper Simple Mills crackers or really any type of cracker to dip in this and it is such a good lunch or even a snack and just, like I said, a great way to get in protein. So I grabbed some new flavors. So honey barbecue, I haven't tried that one. And then I grabbed ranch, this one's really good. I did pick that one up last week. And then bacon ranch, which I've never seen before. And this one sounds really good, urban garlic. And then lastly, the lemon pepper. So I did try the ranch and the lemon pepper. They were both really, really good. And like I said, these are great portable ways to get in protein. We were completely out of dish soap. I did place an order with Grove Collaborative. I will link Grove down below for you guys. I love them. It's a great way to have cleaning products, pet products, home products delivered to your doorstep. I have a discount with them. I'll put everything down below for you. But I did grab a small thing of Dawn to get us by till the order arrives. And then Troy needed a refill on milk. They had no 1% milk at Walmart. So I just went ahead and picked him up the fat-free milk. And then this morning I went to weigh myself and my scale doesn't work. And I actually just changed the batteries. So I think it just died. It is several years old, at least five or six. So I did decide to grab a new scale. This one was on sale at Walmart for $20, which I thought was a really good deal. I also picked up a huge pack of diced ham. This is for Troy's pasta salad. You guys know that he loves this macaroni salad. The recipe is on my website under Troy's salad. So you can search under blog and then just type in Troy's salad and the recipe will pop up. It is not really WW or calorie friendly. It is more of a decadent pasta salad, but the recipe is is on my website. And then I am going to make a pot roast this week in the crock pot because I have some roast from Butcher Box. So I grabbed the crock pot savory pot roast seasoning. This is fantastic. He also needed a restock on cereal. They did not have his fiber one cereal, but they did have the big box of the Kashi toasted berry crisp. He really likes this cereal. And like I told, and like I mentioned in a previous haul, he likes it for the fiber. I needed chicken broth for a recipe. So I went ahead and got bone broth just for the extra boost of protein and then elbow macaroni for the pasta salad. And then I picked up two more of my Chobani completes. I really like having these on hand. These are great for an on the go snack. Troy and I are going to an all day Jeep party thing on Saturday with his Jeep club. So I'm gonna take one of these with me. It is 20 to 25 grams of protein, portable, easy, delicious, and just a great thing to take on the go to get in again that bit of protein. And I probably will take some of the tuna packets as well. He was out of bread for sandwiches, so I picked up a loaf of bread and then some buns 
For the Sloppy Joes, I can't believe I forgot the Sloppy Joe mix. So I will make sure that I pick a big can of that up at my local fry store. I even thought about it as I was walking out of the store and then forgot about it again. I need some sweet potato puree for a recipe. So I decided to grab the cut sweet potatoes, no sugar added. I thought this would be the easiest way to get mashed up sweet potato puree. So we're gonna try this out. I've actually never bought canned sweet potatoes before. So it's going to be a first for me. And then I am making a soup that you guys will actually see in Wednesdays, what I eat in a day. And I needed some turkey meatballs for that. And for my meal prep dessert, I'm making cupcakes. I've been craving cupcakes, like legit craving chocolate cupcakes. So I'm gonna make some. And so I grabbed the zero sugar frosting. I have never tried this, but I've heard really good things about it. They had the chocolate and the vanilla. So we're gonna test that out. I'll definitely let you guys know in meal prep. And then quite a bit of produce. We didn't need any fruit this week. We still have quite a bit left over from last week, but we needed some veggies. So I picked up a big pack of salad mix for Troy. I needed mere Poi, Mirpo, I don't know how you pronounce it, for a dinner recipe. Celery, because we have been loving celery and peanut butter, celery and dip. I did need a couple of zucchinis for my breakfast meal prep, cucumbers for my lunch meal prep, and then we also like to just have cucumbers on hand. You guys know we love our veggies and dip, and that is also why I grabbed two bags of radishes, one for veggies and dip, and then radishes go in Troy's pasta salad, two things of green onions, one for a recipe, one for the pasta salad, and last but not least, a bag of baby carrots. This goes in the pot roast in the crock pot. I did buy case I did buy Troy a case of Diet Coke, which he has already put away in the garage. So let's go ahead and jump into what's on my menu for dinners and what you'll see in Monday's meal prep. So here's what is on my menu for the week. Today's Saturday, we are actually gone the entire day for a Jeep tour, so we'll be going out for dinner. Troy wanted Sloppy Joe's on Sunday. On Monday, I'm making Italian wedding soup. Stay tuned, you'll see this recipe in Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. Tuesday's leftovers, Wednesday I'm throwing a pot roast in the crock pot, and then Thursday and Friday we'll have leftovers as well because we'll have a lot of roasts left as well as Italian wedding soup. Here's what you'll be seeing in Monday's meal prep. I'm super excited about this. For breakfast, I'm making lemon zucchini muffins. My lemons on my lemon tree are just about ready to go, so I can't wait to make my first lemon item. For lunch, I'm doing chicken patties and pickled cucumbers. My mom used to make pickled cucumbers a lot growing up and I miss them, so I'm going to make them. And then for dessert, I've been craving cupcakes. So we are making chocolate cupcakes. So make sure you're subscribed and your bell's on so you don't miss Monday's meal prep. Thank you for joining me for this week's WW Grocery Haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing all the good stuff that I picked up for the week, all the recipes that are on my agenda, what you'll see in meal prep, what I eat in a day, lots of good stuff coming your way. So make sure you're subscribed and your bell's turned on so you don't miss a single video. Give this one a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And of course, check out the description box for nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things, and come join our Facebook group. We'd love to have you. Happy Saturday, friends, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Bye!